This is going to be medication administration through the inhalation phase. Um, so what I have here is I have a stipple mask with a, um, a cup here to put the albuterol and atrovent in. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to take this off. I'm going to uh, make sure that I have the five rights, the right patient, right dose, right medication, right route, and right time. Um, this patient is having a suspected asthma attack, so uh, per standard protocols, I'm going to be getting um, 0.5 milligrams of atrovent. I'm going to get two or a uh, two 2.5 milligrams of albuterol in normal saline solutions, which is going to add up to five milligrams of albuterol. I'm going to put it inside this cup here. Because this is an adult, we use the normal adult dose. If it's a pediatric, it's going to be half that. And I looked at the time, the clarity in the medication, and the expiration date. And I'm going to put this back on. I have that set for this patient. What I'm going to be doing next is making sure that the oxygen works. I'm going to get this tubing. I'm going to be cracking it and turning it on. Know that it works. And for nebulization, uh, per textbook, it is eight to 10 liters per minute to get effective nebulization. So I'm going to be putting this in here. this on eight for proper nebulization. I'm going to coach my patient into proper breathing, so deep inhalation, slow, so that we can get all the medication in. And we're going to be watching for his vital signs to improve. If they um, do not improve, then we're going to think about different indications of um, other procedures that we may use and task complete.